in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Now, here I am, your spiritual father. I'm talking to my children. You're metropolitan. You can see me on the screen and you hear my voice. But what do you think would be if I could actually come in my flesh the way I am, not through camera and television set or Android phone, but I actually in flesh come to you and give you a hug and, and talk to you and you can touch me. Well, I'd love to do that. Maybe someday it will happen. But here's what I want you to understand. We humans, we want to experience reality with our senses. The ability to see, hear, taste, touch, so on. This is how we experience the world around us. So how does God today allow us to see him and touch him and feel and experience and taste? Well, the answer is this. The authentic Orthodox original church, they were known as the Eucharist Assembly. Eucharist. Now you see the pattern and the chalice where the bread and the wine representing the body and the blood of Christ. And then, of course, the priest consecrated. And I'll talk about it later. But now the people of God in the book of Acts, they gathered always for centuries from the beginning for worship, but what was the epicenter, the heart of worship? It was the Eucharist, the Holy Communion. That's the reason why it is so important that we understand, although the Lord Jesus is invisible to our eyes, beyond our ability to touch and feel and taste, we are given the mystical the reality of experiencing his life. The Eucharist Assembly, the Holy Church, you're part of it. The Lord bless you.